Hello guys, how you doing? Here we go, day four, episode four. Getting to know Megan and Wanna with the Battle of the States. The Peach State versus the Sunshine State. Um, so here we go. What would I like to do when I retire? When I retire, I would love to retire and officially be able to do whatever I want. Uh, I would love to be a millionaire at that time. I have, you know, my retirement savings, but of course, when I retire, I know I'm going to have to do more to even uh, keep up with the, um, or surpass the way I'm used to being, living right now, being comfortable. So, I always wanted to get into, like, owning my own rentals. So, that's something I look forward to doing when I retire. Get into, um rentals, rental properties, rental houses, apartments. I always wanted to build from the ground up my own apartment complex. Uh, that's just a big dream and vision that I have and I want to do it. Of course, um, I will have like people working, like contractors and stuff working for me and, and getting it all done, but um, are working with me, under me, I don't know. But definitely owning my own apartment complex, I would love to do that. Get my own rental houses, rental properties. I always had a desire for that. Um, I'm educating myself on it now to be ready for when the opportunity to come. You know, start small with a house or, you know, something like that. But I always wanted to build from the ground up. And I would always go into um, a military town, college town. Uh, definitely military and my heart will always be towards military so I would definitely treat those guys with oh, military I always have my heart just know that um, so yeah rental properties that's something that I want to do when I retire what's my favorite ticket number to scratch so if I go in the store and I'm like hey what ticket number are you on here lately I, um if it's on a certain number that I usually don't buy, I get it because you never know. That could be the, the jackpot ticket. But if it's a ticket on 18, 18 is my absolute favorite ticket number to scratch. Yes, you would have thought it was 9. You would have thought it was 27. No, 18. Because why is 18 my favorite ticket number to scratch? Because I got a claimer on 18. Both of my $1,000 claimers has been on ticket number 18. So that's why I always go for 18. Of course, my favorite numbers are, you ready? My favorite numbers are four. That was my basketball number when I was in high school. My number seven, I always loved seven. Uh, just a blessing just to have number seven. Um, nine and 27. Yep, four is my absolute favorite. Seven, nine, 27, and 18, you know, and eight. You know, I got several numbers. I just can't choose one. Uh, where do I plan to? I guess I'm jumping back to the last question. If I was to retire, where would I retire? Um, not if, excuse me. When I retire, where do I plan on retiring? Where do I plan on calling home? I always thought I live in South Carolina. I love that place. When I was there, uh, I love the Charleston area. But the panhandle was really growing on me. You know that part of Florida? I love it. So I'm reconsidering where I want to live. And make our Florida home. So, um, where I see myself with my channel in the near future, I just continue to upload great content for you guys and uh, having fun. Maybe doing giveaways. Giveaways have left a bad taste in my mouth. Um, it just have, guys. I don't know how else to put it. It's like you be fair. You. you the one time I uh, had two people in my spam, but I went back and I did since they didn't have the fair opportunity to win, I gave them two uh, opportunity to pick a five dollar ticket, and they did. Um, and other people like I don't see my name, I didn't see my name. I, I just take the fun out of it, even giving back. It, I don't know. I'm just not gonna go there today about giveaways, but maybe in the future I do more giveaways. Can you yeah, so that's basically it. Hopefully. I will, um, I plan on continuing to do great videos for you guys. I would love to do other states. Um, so far, I got Georgia, Florida, and California tickets. Um, I have South Carolina tickets on my channel as well. But I would love to scratch off more states. So 
Uh, currently, I'm not able to go check my P.O. box. So if you have seen anything, I haven't been able to check it. But when I do uh, finish up here in Georgia, if you'd like to send some tickets, uh, send it to the P.O. box below. Uh, 5328. Uh, P.O. box 5328, Navarre, Florida. So, yeah. So you guys know a little bit about me. You know my favorite color is blue. You know I'm a drummer. You know how I feel on giveaways. You know how many claim tickets I've had. You know I absolutely love seafood, fago peach soda, um, that cherry dot the pepper. Oh god, uh, guys! You know when I get a burger, <laughs> I'm plain as it can be. I only like nothing on it. It and sometimes I may go only mayonnaise. Only mayonnaise are plain. I don't like all that extraness on it. I know that's crazy, but nope, just simple girl as I can be. Um, you already know what my plans after retirement. So you basically know a little bit more about Millionaire Winner. And hopefully in the days to come, the uploads to come, we'll grow together and make this a big, big channel. All right, guys, thank you for watching. And you know what time it is next? It's time to get into the Battle of the States, the last of the um, two tickets. The Junior Jumbo Bucks versus the Monopoly um, from the state of Florida. Here we go. Okay, here we are. Georgia versus Florida. And let's look at where we stand currently. Currently we have Georgia with $6.00. Florida with two and the tickets that I picked. Maybe I should go more than just um than just five tickets, but I haven't had any anything. But like I said, if we hit a hundred dollars or more, I would get back to you guys a thirty dollar Georgia lottery ticket. So today we hit one hundred dollar on a ticket, single ticket. Gotta be on a single ticket. They got a winner. Georgia, Georgia pulls off a winner. Ticket 14. Um, you'll get a $30 Georgia ticket of your choice, whether it's the Supermax or the Billionaire Club. Um, the Florida tickets came from my favorite store back home, and the Georgia tickets came out of the machine at Wendy's. Okay, nothing. Florida got to come off. Ticket 15. symbol. Oh, I didn't explain how to win on these tickets, but it's self-explanatory. Well, I'm sure you guys have seen these before on my channel, but it's a matching number game for the Monopoly. You get the train symbol, double the prize to get the money back and win all five. The odds on this ticket is one in 4.95. Um, over here for Georgia, uh, it's the same thing. Match any numbers and win numbers. Ready for show and get the jumbo symbol instantly. You win five times the price. That'd be awesome if we can get that five times and it's a hundred dollars, right? A five hundred dollar winner. The odds on this one is one in four point six nine. Okay, ticket seventeen. Let's go. Let's go find that jumbo. Here we go. The Monopoly 217. Did y'all notice that these tickets was basically the same? It's either it's 217 and I just scratched out 17. So we got a double. Way to go, Florida. Florida pulled off a winner. We got a double on 217. All right, 18, my absolute favorite ticket number. Let's go find that jumbo. Give me that $500 winner. I 
ain't nothing. And we have a winner. We put off two winners for the state of Georgia and the last one, 218, for the state of Florida. Four, seven, 14, 12, 11, and okay. So we only got one winner here for the state of Georgia, Florida, excuse me. One winner, and it's the train symbol on 217. And it's a $2 winner. All right, ticket 14. Behind the five is a free ticket, so that's basically a $1 winner. And behind the number nine, we have $3. So in the end, we add the three to the the nine. So that's I mean three to the six to give us nine, and we add the two. So Georgia pull it off with nine to four. Maybe we'll get a chance to do it again. Um, maybe with more tickets and pull off more winners, hopefully. Um, so yeah, guys, that's it. For the battle of the states and the sun the peach state took it took it and guys i scratched with this one coin the whole time 1980 don't say nothing but that's the year i was born i was born in 81. 1981 did i say 1980 1981 scratch with this one coin the whole time yep that's it battle of the states over i'll come back with a, with a recap video but guys thank you for watching and until next time, I'll talk to you later. Peace.